Now we ask you to us in prayer and meditation as Bishop O.C. Lewis shall lead us in prayer. Lord Jesus, our Heavenly Father, we thank you again for another wonderful day. You have blessed us to be in the land of the living, enjoying, praising you, giving you the glory, calling on your great name in the house of the Lord. We thank you for your true plan of salvation that you yourself brought down from heaven and gave it unto men whereby we must be saved. We thank you for our pastor and Apostle Bishop Bethel Green, one you have raised up in the last and evil days to preach this great gospel. Thank you for Lord filling in for him, our assistant pastor, Bishop Melvin Samuel. Pray that you will bless him as he brings forth this wonderful gospel. Oh God, in your great name, let those out there in radio land know that they have to repent from their sins and be baptized in water. In the name of Jesus Christ, Tyre receive the gift of the Holy Ghost and save themselves in this last and evil days. We ask these blessings in your great name. Give me the glory, give me the praise. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Friends and neighbors, you're tuned to the Bible True God's Radio Service coming to you from the Holy Temple Church of the Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostolic Faith. Bishop Belton Green invites you to visit here at Headquarters Temple, located at 2075 Clinton Avenue, Bronx, New York City. Service Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, 7.30 p.m. Sunday, noonday. Now at this time, it is my pleasure to present unto you from the Holy Temple Church of the Lord Jesus Christ, the Assistant Pastor, Bishop Melvin Sanders. What a great salvation. What a wonderful way. What a great salvation. Oh, what a wonderful way. Since I met Jesus, ever since that day. What a great vision. What a wonderful way. Oh, what a great salvation. Oh, what a great salvation. Oh, what a wonderful way. Since I met Jesus, ever since I then. What a great salvation. What a wonderful way. Oh, what a great salvation. What a great salvation. Oh, what a wonderful way. Since I met Jesus, ever since I then. What a great salvation. What a wonderful way. Amen. Amen. Let the church say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Truly indeed again we are bound to give great honor, praise to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, who is the head of our life, the one who is worthy of all the praise. Indeed is worthy of all the honor. Thank him tonight as the song say, for such a great salvation and such a wonderful way he prepared before the face of all people. We do thank God and honor our very own beloved Bishop and Apostle Bishop Belton Green. Thank God always for him. Thank God for his labor sacrifice. He have labored faithfully down through the years. Thank God, praying mightily always for the men of God. Thanking God for him allowing me this privileged opportunity. Come before you all once more. Thank God filling in his stead. Thank God tonight to declare God one and only true plan of salvation Amen. telling the world what they must do to be saved i was sitting here and the scripture dropped in my heart say on a foundation can no man lay yes. than that which is laid my 
God, they say, I've laid the foundation. And out of man build their own. But let every man take heed how we build it there. Because out of foundation can, as 1 Corinthians, 3rd chapter and verse 10. Dropped in my heart so strong Amen. that no man liveth going to be able to get around what God brought to the human family. Everybody going to have to line up with the word of God. The word man of God after Paul fought it and after he got in it, my God, he said you can do nothing against the truth. Yes. But it's going to work out for the truth. That's so it. he spake these words in 1 Corinthians, the third chapter, and verse 10. According to the grace of God. Grace of God. Which is given unto me. Which is given unto me. As a wise master builder. A wise master builder. I have laid the foundation. My God. God, he said, I have laid the foundation. And another build it thereon. Another build it thereon. Let every man take heed. My he God, the mind. Holy Ghost said, take heed. Yes. Let every man take heed. Take heed. How he build it thereupon. How he build it thereupon. Well, other foundation can no man My lay. God, I love this. Other foundation can no man lay. Can no man lay. Which is Jesus Christ. And other foundation can no man lay. Then that is laid. Then that is laid. Which is Jesus Christ. My God, everybody got to come in and build up on that same foundation. Amen. My God, uh, everybody have to come in and line up. My God. God, you better get me Acts chapter, Acts chapter 4 and verse 10. In the 12 verse, it said, Neither is there salvation yes. in any other. For there is none other none name. None other name. Under heaven. My God, under heaven. Given among men. That's the world got to come in and line up. You better start at the 10 verse, 4 and 10. Be it known unto you all. Be it known unto you all. To all the people of Israel. All the people of Israel. By the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. God, you can't get around this name. That by the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Whom you crucified. Whom he crucified. Whom God raised from the dead. Whom God raised from the dead. Even by him do this man stand here before you hold. Stand here before you hold. This is the stone. This is the stone. Which is set at naught of you builders. Set at naught of you builders. Which has become the head of the corner. Head of the corner. Neither is there salvation in any other. My God, all right. My God, the word of God said, neither. Is there salvation? Neither. Is, I don't care what else you try to get around it. Amen. And neither. Is there is salvation? There salvation in any other? In any other? There's no other name under heaven given you, among men. You hear what the word of God said? There is none other name under heaven. Under heaven given among men. And you know you's among men. My God, there is none other name under heaven given among, given men, among men. Whereby we must be saved. Whereby we must. My God, you're going to have to put on that name. You're going to have to put on that name. Amen. As much as we try to get around that name, you're going to have to come on back and line up and put on that name. Philippians chapter 2 and verse 10. People try to get around Jesus. But my God, you're going to have to come on back and line up and put on that name because neither is there salvation in any other. For there is none other name in the heaven given, given among, among men, men whereby, whereby we must. Philippians 2 and verse 10. Not at the name. Not at the name of Jesus. Not at the name of Jesus. Every knee shall bow. My God, you're going to have to bow here. My God, if you don't bow, you're going to bow later. 
My God, I rather humble myself under the mighty hands of God. Oh, yes. That at the name of Jesus. Every knee shall bow. Every knee. Every knee. Every knee. Every knee shall bow. Of things in heaven. Things in heaven. And things in earth. And things in earth. And things under the and earth. things under the earth. And that every tongue shall confess. Oh, you're going to have to confess. That Jesus. My God. That Jesus. Is Christ. Is Christ. Is Lord to the glory of God the Father. The glory of God the Father. Wherefore, my beloved. My God, wherefore, my beloved. As you have always obeyed, now in my presence. All you have to do is surrender. That's it. My God, surrender. And the day of Pentecost, yes. when they heard Peter, and the day of Pentecost in Acts chapter 2 and verse 37, my God went as Peter preached the gospel under the inspiration of the Holy Ghost, sent down from heaven. When they heard this, they were pricked in they the heart. They were pricked in the heart. And said to said Peter, unto and Peter, to Peter, and to the and rest, to of, the the rest of the apostles, men and men brethren, and brethren what, shall we, what shall we do? Then Peter, then said, unto Peter them, said unto them, Repent, repent and, be and be baptized, every one of you, every one of in you, the name of in Jesus the Christ. name of Jesus Christ. For the remission For of For the sins. removal of your sin can be yes. removed and blotted out. For the remission of sin. And you shall and receive, the, shall gift of receive the, Holy Ghost. the gift of the Holy Ghost. For the promise, For unto the you. promise is unto you. And to your children. And to your children. To all that are all far off. Are far off. Even as many Even as the Lord as our God many. shall call. And he's calling all nations from the rising of the sun. Could it go in down thereof? Even as many. The and Lord our God shall call. Read on. And with many other words he testify. Testify. And exhort saying. Exhort saying. Save yourself. Save yourself. From this untold generation. My God, somebody somewhere out there in Raider Land, wherever you are, when you hear this gospel, you ought to get busy. Do something about it concerning your soul. Pick up the phone and call us up. Call us up. Pick up the phone, my God. I say, and, uh, why tarriest thou? Arise and be baptized, calling on the name of the Lord. Somebody out there, don't let the enemy deceive you. Take them captive at his own will. Break loose. Pick up the phone and call us up. 718. Huh? 584 584 Do something about your soul. Do something if you don't have your phone. Pick up your pen and paper. My God, and take the number. Do something. My God, or write the address and start. Do something about yes. your soul. Call us up. My God, you need to do something. You need to save yourself, beloved. My God, don't continue. What shall we say then? Shall we continue? My God, you don't want to continue in sin. The word of God said, come out. Come out from among them. What a blessing when you can be then made free from sin. You don't have to continue. In, in Romans chapter 6 and verse 1, he asks the question, what shall we say then? Shall we continue? Shall we continue? You don't have to continue. You can free yourself tonight. My God, you can free yourself. Yes. Shall, what shall we say then? Shall we shall continue? We sin? continue in sin. That grace may that abound. Grace may abound. God, forbid. God forbid. How shall we, How shall we read on? Live any longer Live therein. any longer therein. Know ye not. Know ye not. There's so many of us that were baptized into Jesus Christ. Call us up. Come and get the baptism. You can be delivered from sin. Neither is there salvation in any other. There is none other name and the heaven given among men whereby must we be must saved. be saved. Read on. Know ye not. Know ye not. There's so many of us that were baptized into Jesus Christ. Into Jesus Christ. Were baptized into his death. Baptized into his death. Therefore we are buried with him by Be baptism. By baptism. 
baptism into death. Into death. Like as Christ is raised up from the dead. Read on. By the glory of the Father. Hallelujah. Even so. Even so. We shall also walk in the newness he, of life. He, he gave you a new life. Drop on down to verse 17 now. He gave you a new life. And it's uh, 617. Read on. No, ye not. No, ye not. And to whom ye yield yourself servant to obey. Read on. And serve ye are to whom ye obey. To whom ye obey. Whether of sin unto death. Read on. Or obedience, uh, of obedience unto righteousness. Hallelujah. But God be thanks. My God, that's why we are so happy. That's why we are so thankful. That's why we're in here rejoicing. But God be thanked. That you were the servant of Hallelujah. sin. Hallelujah. My God, that's Romans 6, 18. But God be thanked. You were that the servant of sin. My God in the past tense. But now in the present. And such was some of you. But now we are washed. My God, my God. We are clean. We were. We were. Yes. We were. The servant of sin. But we yeah, well, were. Yes. That's why. We were. I want the world to know. Hallelujah. Praise if God. every man be in Christ, he is a, he new, is a new creature. Talk oh. about us. Put us down. But we are in Christ. Hallelujah. But God be thanked. That you were we were. Son, the servant of sin. But you have obeyed. We obey. From Acts 2.38. From the heart. That form, that of, form doctrine, of doctrine. Which was delivered Hallelujah. You. Which was delivered you. Then they made free from sin. That's what free us. Free. Free from sin. Those people over there in Acts chapter 19, you don't have to read it. After they believed the gospel and got it right, they burn up all the rest of books. They get rid of everything. When you're made free, you get rid of everything. It, you say, it's not another. Yes. It's not another. It we are free. free. We are free. Somebody talk about you all the want. I remember you. I remember this. I remember that. But talk about now. But I know. Hallelujah. Yes. If any man be in Christ, he is, he is a new creature. That's what the world needs to do. Come and get in Christ. Come and get in Christ. Don't stay out there. Hallelujah. And establish something on your own. Your own set of won't save you. You need to humble yourself and get in Christ. I see why Apostle Paul cried out, Brethren, my heart desire and prayer to God. I'm in Romans chapter 10 and 1. For Israel is that they might be saved. What's the matter, Paul? I bear them record. They have a seal of God. Your seal won't save you. They have a zeal back there in Elijah. My God, the zeal was so strong till they launched themselves. They cut themselves. Blood run out. But that's still going to deliver them. My God, your zeal won't deliver you. All right. Have a zeal of God. But not according to knowledge. Not according to knowledge. They be ignorant of God righteousness. Ignorant of God righteousness. What about to establish your own righteousness? Beloved, you can't go about establishing it. My God, you have to come down back and submit yourself. Hallelujah. My God, you got to humble down. Amen. All right, get me Philippians. Let me close out. My God, Philippians chapter, I believe, third chapter and verse five. Listen what the man of God say. My God, oh, Paul said what thing was gained to him. He counted loss. Yes. You're going to have to give up. My God, something to follow Jesus. Philippians 3rd chapter verse 5. Circumcised the eighth day of the stock of Israel. He given his background. Mm -hmm. Read on. Of the tribe of Benjamin, the Hebrew. He said, I came out the tribe of Benjamin. Hebrew. He said he was a Hebrew. Of the Hebrew. He said he was a Hebrew of yes. the Hebrew. Yes, and but, touching the law of yes. Pharisee. Read on. Concerning zeal, persecuting the church. He have a lot of zeal. But not according to knowledge. That's, That's why he have to write that and leave and record. Persecuting the church. Yes, persecuting the church, such in righteousness. Read on. Which is in the law. Read on. Blameless. Blameless. But what thing will gain to me? What thing? I don't care what you gain out there. 
You're going to have to give it up for Christ. Yes. What thing was gained to me? Those I count lost for Christ. God, you better give it up for Christ. You better give it up and come on in here. Humble yourself and get baptized. If you drop on down a few births, you see why? Because that I might be found in him. Mm -hmm. Not having my own righteousness. Which is of the law. Your own righteousness not going to save you. Listen, if that I'll and, read on, what is it? Being found in him. Being found in him. Not having my own righteousness. All right, your own righteousness not going to save you. Yes, sir, Bishop. Which right. is in the law. In the law. the law. Read but on. that which is through faith. True faith. Read on. And the righteous which is of God by faith. By faith. That's what you got to do. You got your own righteousness, not going to save you. God bless you. God keep you. My God, don't be afraid. Call us up. Write to us. You got to repent. You got to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sin. God bless you. God keep you. Amen. We'll be back next week, Lord. It's willing the same station, same hour, the same day. You can call Bishop Belton Green at 718. 5840691. Again, you can reach Bishop Belton Green at 718-584-0691. You may also visit us on the web at www.theholytemplechurch.net. Again, you can visit us on the web at www.theholytemplechurch.net. Until then, may God richly bless you is our prayers. That's all right. My soul is resting. Ain't that a blessing? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm free. Let's give God a hand clap. Amen. Thank God for that wonderful selection coming from the Young Adult Choir. Thank God, say hallelujah, I'm free. In a world like this, in the midst of a crooked, perverse, it's all crooked, perverse, and you can, in the midst of it all, you can say I'm free. Don't let nobody, don't let the devil lie to you, you know, the devil is a liar. You can walk around from here, around here. You may not have a penny in your pocket, but you can say, I'm free. Yeah. Peter, the, Peter, Peter and John said, silver and gold have I none. Such as I have. But they have something. Praise God. They were free. Amen. That make that lame man walk. I ain't going to hold you all along. But what I want to confirm, you can be free in God. In the midst, this whole world is crooked. Crooked. Oh, yeah. My God, this, whole, this is a crooked. I believe Philippians 2 and 12. This, in the, we are living in the midst of a crooked. People, the, the Bible says, the, the, the wicked. You know the wicked? He just watching. Oh, yeah. The right. Young people, middle age. Every one of us, that's in Psalms 37, 32. The wicked now, not the righteous. Not the righteous watching the righteous to pull him down. Is the wicked. Oh, yes. What did he say? Psalm 37. 32, I believe. Praise God. Let me see. 37, I believe that's what why did it say? Psalm 37, 32. Oh. Praise God. The wicked. Who doing the job? The wicked. The wicked. The ungodly man. Mm -hmm. Dig at a pit. And wait for the righteous to fall in it. That's right. But God can guide you around whatever the devil set up. Who did it? The, the wicked. Watch is the righteous. The wicked is on the job. He watcheth the righteous. And seeketh to slay him. My God, the wicked. Oh, yes. Who love to destroy every child of God. Right about that. Seeketh to slay him. Yes. But 
The Lord would not leave him in his hand. God ain't going to let the enemy rejoice over. He ain't going to give him the, his desire. The Lord won't leave us. Do you hear what the word of God said? The Lord won't leave us. He's not going to do it. He's not going to do it. He's not going to do it. He's waiting for it. But God said, I'm not going to leave them in your hand. No, Hallelujah. Him. Hallelujah. I won't do it. I won't do it. The devil tell God, say, how can I touch him? You put a hedge around him. You have him hedging. You have him protective. Move the hedge. God can hedge you around. The wicked. The wicked and the job, saints. The wicked and the job. The wicked watcheth the righteous. And seek it to slay he him. Seek it to do what? Slay him. He seek he want us slay us. That's it. But what? The Lord will not leave him in his hands. He said, Have thou considered my servant Job? Yes. You 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 go, I won't leave them. Hallelujah. I'm not gonna leave them. In his hand. Hallelujah. God said, I'm not they're seeking. They're watching. They're lurking. They're doing all they can do to pull the child of God down. But God said, I won't leave them in your hand. I'm not gonna give them the victory over you. You are kept by the power of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're not out there on our own. The eyes of the Lord. Just like he watcheth the righteous and seek to slay. Just like the wicked out there watching the righteous and seek to slay him. God looking at his righteous. That's I right. believe he's saying First Peter, third chapter and verse 12. Just like the enemy watching. God is on the job. What the Lord say. First Peter, third chapter and verse 12. The what eyes say? of the Lord. Huh? The eyes. The eyes. God got his eyes. Glory to God. He's one place he said, he set his eyes upon us for good. Yes. The eyes of the Lord. All over the righteous. The enemy watching the righteous and seek to slay him. That's but God it. said, I got my eyes. My eyes is over the righteous. And his ears. My eyes is over the righteous. I'm not going to leave them in your hand. My eyes is over the righteous. Yes, in his ears. Hallelujah. His ears. Oh, open unto their open. prayer. Open. Unto their prayer. Do you hear what they say? The eyes of the Lord over the right. are over the righteous. His ears. His ears. Oh, open unto his prayer. Open to his prayer? Yes. Psalms 91 and verse 15. The eyes of the Lord are over the righteous yes. and his ears. All you got to do, what he tell us to do now? He shall call. He shall call. Upon me. He shall call. Upon me. God has got his eyes upon you. Just tell God, Lord, Lord, come by here, Lord. Come by here, Lord. Your child need help, Lord. He shall call up. And me. And I will answer him. Eh? I will he shall him. call. Call upon God, saints. Don't be afraid. When trouble come, when the test come, you better open your mouth and call Jesus. Jesus. In the name of the Lord. It is a strong tower. The righteous run on therein. And there we are saved. I will call. If I got to call all night long, he shall call. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Gonna defeat the devil yes. calling on Jesus. You can defeat him, saints. There's power in his name. He shall call on me. Hallelujah. I'm going to call on him. Hallelujah. He shall call on me. And me. I will answer him. God, what? God say I'm going to answer. God say I'm going to be there. He be there. He shall call. I'm going to defeat the devil. We're going to defeat the devil. We're going to bruise it and him. And I need our feet. Praise God. I'll wrestle all night long. 
If I got to pray, pray all night long. If I got to cry, I cry all night long. He shall call upon me. While they talking, I'm calling Jesus. While they talking, I'm calling Jesus. He shall call upon me. Upon me. And I will answer him. Eh? I will answer him. God said, I'm going to answer him. Come on, Bishop. Uh huh. Yes, I will be with him. I'm going to be with him. In trouble. I'm going to be with him. Come on now. You're going to have trouble. But I'm going to be there Glory for you. God. You're going to have trouble. You're going to have trial. Yes. I know the wicked watching yes. you. I know he's seeking how to slay you. But I won't leave you in his hand. Yes. Just call on me. You shall call. Yes. Hallelujah. He shall call. Upon me. And I will answer him. Eh? I will answer him. Some of you say, I've been calling. I don't get the answer as yet. But listen what he said. Isaiah 65, 24. It shall come to pass. It shall come to pass. Sometimes people calling somebody that can't do nothing for them. But the Holy Ghost say, acquaint them. Now yourself with him. He shall call. Yes. Isaiah 65, 24. It shall come to pass. That before they call. Before you open your mouth. Before you get the word out. Yes. He see you coming. On, he Jesus. know what you're going through. He can be touched with the very feeling Hallelujah. of our infirmity. Yes, Sometimes Lord. you're so low, you're not able. You can hardly get Hallelujah. the word out. Sometimes Hallelujah. you're down so low. Yes. But the Bible said, let the brother of low degree. I'm going to rejoice. I'm at my low point. But the Bible said, it shall come to pass. Yes, you Lord. fight. But I'm going to come. Hallelujah to God. Talk about me. Talk about me. Pull me down. But while you're doing that, I'm gonna come out. Hallelujah to God. Hallelujah to God. Talk about me as much as you want. But I'm gonna go on. I can call and it shall come to pass before they call. Hallelujah to God. Before they call, I will answer. Uh -huh. Before I will you answer. call, I will answer. God say I'm gonna answer. While they yet speaking, before you get the word out, I will. I'm hear. gonna answer. Yes. Because I'm God, and I cannot lie. I gotta stand by my word. I tell you, you shall call upon me in the day of trouble, and I'm gonna answer. Yes. Before you call, I will, I will answer. And while you yet speaking, I will hear. That's the God we serve, saints. That's the God we serve. Somebody say, if you know the Lord is keeping you, then what you got to worry about? Don't worry. You can be sure over here. Bible says, we are for the rod of brethren. Give diligence. Make your calling. You can be sure. Somebody walking around here, sure. Hallelujah to God. Praise David God. said, I would have fainted unless I believe to see, see the, the goodness of the Lord. But Peter said in 2 Peter 1 and verse 10, wherefore the rod of brethren, Real give diligence, make great. your calling. And you sure. can be sure. Paul was sure. After all they did, they stoned him, they beat him. He went through a lot, but in the end he was sure. He was so sure till he closed it out. In 2 Timothy, I believe 4 and 6. Let's hear what the, what, the, what Paul said. He shipwrecked, stoned, beaten, but he closed it out. Listen to his closing remarks. What? 2 Timothy 4 and 6? Yes. Why well, I'm not ready. Saints, you can hang on in here till you say, I'm not ready. To be offered. I'm ready to be offered. The time of my departure is at hand. Is at hand. I have fought. I, God, you can fight it out, saints. I have fought. I fight. A good fight. I have finished my course. The glory to God. He said, I have finished my course. I have kept I, the faith. He 
kept the faith. Henceforth. Henceforth. He, crown of he was sure. He never said, I think. I believe. I think. I, I, a crown of righteousness. Mm -hmm. He was sure. He said, henceforth. It's laid up for me. For who, Paul? Uh, laid up for me. He never said, I think. No. I believe. He said, henceforth. It's laid up for me. It's laid up for me. Crown of righteousness. Yes. Which the righteous Lord. The, the which, righteous judge. Which the Lord, the righteous. righteous. You see, give me. he's the one got his eyes on you. He set his eyes on you for good. Amen. And he got the righteous judge. Yes. Going to give you. At that day. At that day. And not to me only. Not to me only. And to all them that also they love his appearance. Right on, saints. They sing a song and say, you fight on. What the song they say? You fight on. You fight on. You fight on. Yes. You fight on. You fight on. My God, Minister Eric, you've been fighting a long time, son. You fight on. You fight on. You fight on. Sometimes it look like you're down to just a few. Sometimes one place, he say, all men forsook me. Hallelujah. People will back upon you, but God stood by him. You fight on. All I can encourage you saying, you fight on. You fight on. He says, stay on board. You fight on. You fight on. The reward is too great. You fight on. Fight it out, saints. God bless you. God keep you.